I want to bring back our legal panel, Defense Attorney Jeff Gold and Attorney Brian Kabatek joining us now. Uh, Jeff, I'm curious what your thoughts are when you hear that statement. Well, first of all, I, I agree with it 100%. You know, Mikhail, I attended the trial, and I don't think anyone who attended the trial could not sympathize with that juror. I don't see how in the world anybody who was there could have done anything under the law but acquit. And what she's doing, of course, is responding. There was a statement earlier by four other jurors sort of distancing themselves from her, uh, and she's sympathizing with the Martin family. Hey, look, all those protesters out of there, if they're really um, protesting, they ought to be against the Stand Your Ground law, not really George Zimmerman. I think there was nothing else for this jury to do uh, under Florida law. Brian, it sounds as though she felt her hands were tied. I'm curious about this notion of her getting her life back on track. That is something that I think a lot of folks haven't talked about. But let's talk about this idea. My prayers are with those who have the influence and power to modify the laws that left me with no verdict option. Jeff, speaking to that as well, I want your thoughts. Well, I thought this trial was over before it got started because of that jury instruction. I knew that jury instruction was going to be given. We talked earlier in the show about self-defense, the, the common law self-defense, which has a fight or flight provision, meaning you can walk away from a situation, you don't get to use the defense, or at least the jury makes a decision whether or not you could walk away. Florida doesn't have that. That's the problem. Florida has a law that specifically says you don't have to walk away. And as soon as you apply that, as soon as you have that jury instruction in place, you are in a situation where the jury doesn't get to consider whether or not George Zimmerman could have walked away from the situation. So this is the problem. And what I've told people since this verdict came out, and people approach me, they ask me about the case, they ask me what I think, I say the real problem here is the law. If people don't like the verdict, change the law. Of yeah. course, in Florida, that's a difficult situation. Brian Kabatek, Jeff Gold, thanks so much for sticking around with us. We'll have more news for you after this quick break.